that lovely moment when you can no longer lose weight, get good sleep, or shop at The Gap? You generally feel like crap and then someone tells you it's just a part of getting old. That moment? You can either believe them or do something about it. Your choice. Hey, it's Kim Castle. You're watching Kim TV, where you discover how to live agelessly. You know that time in a woman's life when she's raised healthy and happy children, been an unwavering partner to her spouse, was always there for her parents, given her everything she's got, and then some to her career, and then she wakes up one day and thinks, you can all go screw yourself. I am not getting out of this bed, ever. I dug a hole so deep I wondered if I would ever get out of it. You know, foggy brain, can't think straight, fatigue, exhaustion, depression, my hair thinning and falling out, uncontrollable weight gain, waking up at 3.30 in the morning filled with anxiety, crying, saying, this is not my beautiful life. Turns out it was hormones. My only previous experience with hormones was calling a highly excitable friend in high school a hormone. I think that's the meanest thing I have ever said. Robbie, if you're watching, I'm so sorry. I hope things have calmed down for you. The awful thing is I felt so bad for so long and I didn't even know it. You know, the frog in slowly boiling water kind of thing. I felt like crap, but I didn't know there was something I could do about it. I thought it was normal to go through my entire closet getting ready for a party and end up crying and texting my friend crumbled on the pile of clothes on my bed that I'm not coming, opting for sweats, peanut butter, neat, and a binge marathon of scandal. As things got progressively worse, I couldn't function at work. I was late all the time, even when I tried to take care of myself by getting massages. I knew things had gotten bad when I was running down the sidewalk on my way to the spa, literally yelling at people, get out of my way, I'm trying to relax. And I was depressed, so depressed. And I didn't even know it. I'm one of those annoyingly optimistic, positive people. Half full, half empty, I'm full even when I'm empty. It had gotten to a point that I was happy for cloudy days so that I didn't have to match the sun. Seriously, like I'm in competition with the friggin' sun? What kind of sick person would say something like that? A woman out of hormonal balance, that's who. Hormones control just about every aspect of our physical and mental health. And when they go off kilter, they can trigger anything from acne to insomnia to memory loss and weight gain. Instead of planting flowers, you want to tear them apart. Hormone comes from the Greek word hormanis, which means to put in motion. Interesting, huh? Without hormones, your body will not function. They affect metabolism and growth. Maintain your body's mineral balance, salt and water balance, blood sugar level. They affect your mood and your ability to focus. They regulate how much you eat and how much your body uses it as fuel or whether it decides to set up house on your stomach, butt, and thighs. No matter how much you work out, in fact, the wrong kind of working out makes it worse. Or how little you eat, if your hormones are out of balance, your bod ain't listening. Hormones start dwindling in our early to mid 30s. I know, right? Why didn't anybody tell us? We're told it's a part of getting older and we believe them and then went on to get old. It can take 10 to 15 years for us to even notice the changes caused by the loss of hormones. And by then, we can barely get through our day, much less pull ourselves out of the hell hole that we feel, but we don't talk about. All because we don't have the right body cocktail. Thyroid hormone, T3 and T4, for example, helps control your metabolism. ADH maintains water balance. Estrogen affects how much chocolate you must eat. There are over a hundred different hormones in your body calling all the shots. Seriously, all the shots. It's not just a female thing. It's not just a menopause thing. They run the ship and they all work in tandem with each other. Even a slight increase or a decrease of any one of them can not only make you look old and feel old, they can form the basis for illnesses like arthritis, diabetes, cancer. Coupled with the stress of all the things we have to do as moms and professionals, as women who want to be seen as beautiful and sexy, it can become an uphill battle that we cannot win. If hormones are not in check, the deck is stacked against us. And that's where I was heading. After years of pushing this little engine that could be on my capacity year after year, not listening to the subtle signs it was giving me, not understanding how my body works, especially the effect of hormones, not paying attention to the signs my body was telling me, like waking up wide awake in the middle of the night in panic, being so depressed that no amount of chocolate would help. 
Little did I know, I was aging ungracefully. For all my working out, striving to look good on the outside, I had no idea I was digging my own grave. Thank goodness I got help. I worked with an integrative doctor who showed me what the heck was wrong with me. By changing my major type A tendencies, my diet, taking bioidentical hormones and supplements, I'm back to loving my life again and everything in it. I learned firsthand there really is something you can do about all those things that you're feeling. There really is so much you can do about hormones. It ain't your mama's hormone replacement therapy. It all starts with becoming aware of what's really going on in here. What changes are you noticing? Let me know in the comments below or tweet me at Kim Castle, hashtag happy hormones. Coming up, you'll hear from the doctor that I worked with, find out what people really know about hormones, and I talk with some girlfriends to find out what's working for them. Thank you so much for inviting me into your life today. Be sure to share Kim TV with a woman that you love. Until next time, live life on full. And if you're new here, welcome to Kim TV. Subscribe and make yourself known. Every week I share tips and resources and answers on the anti-aging road back to vitality, energy, and feeling your best. By subscribing, you'll be personally notified when I do. And then you can be a part of the conversation. Just log into YouTube with your Gmail account, subscribe by clicking on the red button, and share your experience in the comment section below. Resources and answers on the anti- 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 the anti